There was a guy named Tabachnik, that was the only name I knew him by, who had a glorious voice, tenor. He could sing like a bird. And he was very frum. He wore a black cape capoting with a rope around his waist, no leather. And he was quite mad. I don't know if he was alcoholic or, or um, mental problems, I don't know. But he would come down the street sometime, in the middle of the street, in Chambers Street in the West End, singing and shouting at the top of his lungs, and the kids would all tease him. Here comes Tabachnik, and the kids would rush out at him, and he had a staff, like a prophet just come down off the mountain with his staff, and he'd scare the kids, and we'd all go running into the hallways and hide, and he'd go on singing down the street. There was a very small shul on Beacon Hill called the Joy Street Shul, a very small congregation, not much money to work with, but they would hire Tabachnik to sing for the high holidays. He had a glorious voice and he knew the material. He was a brilliant student. I think he maybe had studied for the rabbinate, I'm not sure. They could hire him because if he didn't show up, it was okay. They had congregants who would take over the service. It was no big deal. But if he showed up, they had a glorious voice singing to them. They paid him $500 for the high holiday services. And the story was that there was a local, very successful liquor store merchant owner who would finance him, subsidize him through the course of the year. He would go to that store, Tabasha would go to that store every week, and they would give him maybe $10 <clears throat> to pay his room rent and his food needs and whatever else he needed to get through the week. And next week he'd come back in another $10. And when he sang for the high holidays, he'd get that $500, he'd walk in there and pay off his debt. That's the way it worked, which was a lovely local legend. So when the high holidays came around, if we heard that Tabasha was singing, we would go, we'd sneak in to the Joy Street Show just to hear him because it was really something. It was like an operatic tenor. It was wonderful, wonderful to listen to.